physically, I'd be like, mm, yeah. Like, ah, I don't like that. Yeah, I don't, I don't particularly like it. But if you like it, then you do it. Yep. That's what I tell them. I don't say like, oh, yeah, I like that, even though it's ugly. Now, if it's like, if it's like, oh, that's my grandma's, like, ring. Like, she died from saving a homeless kid. Like, then I'd be like, yeah, If it has great. special meaning. Yeah, I'm not going to. But if it's just some random article that they, yeah. No, I have I... at least some kind of empathy. And, like, patience when I work. Of course I'm going to white lie to them. Holographic meatloaf again? I white lie when I need to. Jordan whites lies every second of his life. That is what I'm trying to get at. I mean, she's like she's not totally wrong. Um, I will tell him to tell me the truth, and he will lie to my face. And I'll be like, why did you just lie to me? And he'll be like, oh, because I, I, that's what I thought you wanted to hear. Basically, yeah. And then I'm just like, no. I'm just a people pleaser, that's all. I am not. <laughs> I have anxiety, not autism. They, they kind of run. Um, I'm on the spectrum, I guess, whatever. We all are. <laughs> it's called self-preservation. Yeah, I'm just smart. No, you're um, not, because then I just yell at you for chronic lying, for lying, whatever you do. Um, no, my birthday's in April. I'm a Taurus. What was I gonna say? I don't know. I don't know. I can't remember. Oh, I'm just really bad at, like, telling people what they don't want to hear. So instead, I give alternative truthful answers, such as, Yeah, I should really do that. Yeah, I should really check that out. That's me saying no. I just don't want to say no. Oh, God, he's so bad at that. I know when he's saying no. I just, I just say alternative versions of the word no that isn't those two letters. Wow, it's the golden snatch. No way. No, I'm sober. I don't drink. I don't think Robin's been drunk in like a year. Probably the last time I was drunk was our wedding. Yeah. Hi, Toe Crocs. I have the attitude of a New York City gal. So. Now, where was I? Oh, yes. The greenhouse won't keep itself in order without a no, nudge from me. Make myself happy, not everybody else. Um, do you think you could bring me my water? I think it's in the kitchen. Why is it in the kitchen, Jordan? I was gonna, like, fill it, and I think I forgot. So you need me to fill it, too? Or should well, I bring you an empty? Well, I don't remember if I filled it and then forgot. If I didn't fill it, would you fill it? Yeah, I will. Thank I you. Will, baby. Thank you. I appreciate it. I promised Sebastian I would meet him in Feldcroft. He hopes meeting a new student will bring some bring some cheer to his sister Anne. But something ominous is happening in Feldcroft. <gasps> she was drunk when we first met, yes, which surely played a part in us being together to this day. Holy fuck! What are we go we're going way the hell down there? Jeez! Ay, Dios mío. We're going on a trip. On my favorite. Um. Revelio. My favorite. Uh, broomstick. What? What kind of house did I just break into? I probably should get out of here, man. Oh, my flashbang. Thank you so much, honey. You're welcome. I really appreciate that. I do like that. Oh, wait, Dan. Yeah, you do, but like older ginger. Dan's kind of ginger. Oh, I guess yeah, he is. Beehives. The wizarding world needs honey for their tea as much as the muggle world does. 
Did you bake that person? I did. Let me see. He does look like Dan. Doesn't it? Crap, yeah. Yeah, I know. That's funny. That's funny. funny. Yeah, the face customization wasn't that in-depth. I couldn't... You know, I did as much as I could. Zoe loves to just fucking throw that thing on the floor. Just... It's because she chews it halfway off the bed. Why do you throw your bones on the floor? Oh, she just wants attention. Yeah, probably. She's trying to get me to look at it. Yeah, look at me. Oh, hey, I can actually unlock this. I like it when you sit through death. You can you Time to do a little breaking and entering, boys. Let's go. Have you played Saints Row 2? Yes. Maybe I played 3. I can't remember. 3 is kind of funny. It's kind of like... It's a sci-fi thing. 2 is my favorite. All I remember about my playthrough of Saints Row... Was kitties! Hi, kitties! Good kitty. Where's your what? All I remember about my playthrough of Saints Row was that my character had chrome oh. skin, <laughs> That's and like the third, then. <laughs> and I, I had a giant dildo for a melee weapon. I like um, Saints Row 2, the pimp cane, because you'll like walk mm. like a pimp, and then you can like uh. bring it up, and it's a shotgun. That's pretty dope. That's my favorite weapon. Dude, that has got to be the greatest kind of breaking and entering. I broke in their house, stole a little bit of stuff, and pet their cats. And now I'm leaving. And they're purrins. They're happy, you know? They approve. You left the door open so they know. No, oh, it'll close. Oh, okay. That's cool. What? That's kind of cool. Can you go up high in the air? Yeah. Oh, that's sweet. I can go fast. I wanted to play this game so bad, but I have no life besides nursing school. Well, you'll have to play it when you can. Oh, look, enemies! You motherfuckers wanna go? No, I haven't learned that yet, but I think I will eventually. Huh? I have like 15 hours in already. Oh, okay. Never mind. You're pretty good. You're pretty good. I don't know. Honestly. Sleek dueling. Avoiding off problems. I hope. I want to play Skyrim again. Hmm. I want to play that Pokemon game. Oh, Pal World? Uh huh. I want to play It Takes Two, too. We do need to finish it. <laughs> <laughs> I turned them into a fucking chicken. Yeah, approximately. It has been fun. I remember. We laughed so hard. <laughs> the hell is this? I kept falling off. Rebellion. Yeah, the game is a giggler. Doxy egg. Stolen by poachers for using potions. These black eggs come from a doxy, a magical beast sometimes mistaken for a fairy. You and me, baby, ain't nothing but mammals, so let's do it. Those are on sale, I I only got this thing because it was cheap as hell. You, like lock picking level? Yeah. Where is it at? Oh, the phone boys, we got a 15 month resub from Digifreak0445. 
Fooper. Be free, you little fooper. How fucked up would have that been if I would have just opened the cage and then caught him? That's probably what it wants me to do, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, I lost him. Wow. Let's see what's up your sleeve this time, though. Tragic, really. Oh, look, more people to kill. God damn. Getting a little distracted here, but. Gives me, like, Harry Potter. Ravelli. Pretty much what it is. You! Let's see you Oh my god, what the fuck? Stop that right now. Stop that right now. How is he taken, Robin? He is... He is pretty tanky. Yeah. Courage in a pool. I asked I asked the chat and they all said I was a Hubble Puff. Why do you think I'm a Hubble Puff, bro? The beast is safe now. No, I don't think I'm smart enough for that. I'm a Slytherin, so we all know that. I yeah. Yeah, I'm a Slytherin. Akio bum. I'll take Professor Snape. He's great. He's my favorite. Snape. Snape. Hello, Hamora. Severus Snape. I am not a Ravenclaw. I am a Slytherin. I am sometimes dumb. Okay, I gotta catch this thing right away now. I gotta be real fucked up with it, you know? Just get right on it. Cage beast cannot be rescued. We'll get out then. Oh, oh I suppose I gotta cast Let like. Arrest the momentum. Get back here, motherfucker. Can you bring me go? Oh, yeah, I guess. Well, it's your fault. Awesome. <laughs> I suppose that's what I gotta do is like Where capture did, oh, it right it's away. Right there. Where? It's right there. Oh, I see him. I can't get it while I'm on my broom though. Maybe he'll land. Glacius. No. No. Get back here, you naughty fooper. Oh, whatever, bro. It ain't meant to be, alright? It's not meant to be. I want to see you catch it. I can just go straight up this fucking mountain. I don't think I can. Just pass it. Right? Yeah. I think I have to go down and around. Yeah, I do. Who made this game? I do not know what studio made it. I know I can't enter wall mount either, right? I'm trying to ride the wall. My only complaint about this game, there's no Quidditch. There really isn't? Oh. Got some rare things for sale, stranger? Hello. Do you have anything for sale? Hello. <laughs> It's not mm. often I see how good students are during the school year. Yeah, I am way the fuck I'm out Priya here. I'm Priya Treadwell at your service, and I sell a variety of traveling necessities. May I see your wares? What do you have for sale? I'm Let's J have a look, shall we? I'm JK. I don't want to buy your stuff. I want to sell my stuff to you, though. Hey, Molo Sweet Leaves, I will buy that. Actually. You won't be disappointed. I can promise you that. I didn't think I'd be the one doing the buying. Yeah, you're gonna do lots of buying, actually. So nice.
nice of you to stop by. I'm on the road again. Just can't wait to be on the road again. Feldcroft region. Revelio. My father. Jeweled brooch. The gorgeous brooch depicts a magical bird of some sort. Which particular magical bird is unclear, but some believe it's meant to represent one of the medieval Irish druidess Cliodna's birds who sang the sick to sleep. It was magical. Cliodna's. Alohomora. Break and enter, drink their beer, steal their wand? Holder, I guess. Why do I see a cave entrance? Do you see one of these, though? Could it be a Merlin trial? Look at that pumpkin! Jesus! Revelio. There must be more. Oh. I feel like me attacking that scarecrow right there was the equivalent of uh, You'll enjoy your time in repeatedly Iron knifing the uh, the bus driver on transit. <laughs> it's all fun and games, so you really make him mad. Okay, there's got to be more. But where? Huh. Not so tricky after all, Merlin. We did it! Hooray! Alohomora. What is the point of putting a lock on your house if any regular old wizard like me could just fucking break in like this? Rebellion. Let's see if this runs any better on D DLSS today. It was really weird that one time. I don't know why. What, there's another Merlin trial right here? Literally, like, right next to each other. 
wonder how many Merlin trials there are in total. Probably a shitload, I guess. Rebellion. Oh, jeez. Looks like it's fire. There's one. There's two. And there's three. Confringer! Easy. Wonder if I'm safe to explore in there. I'm on the road to get in where. Winder eggs. Incendio. Yes, I have enjoyed this game very much. Poachers, I suppose. Seems quiet. Clicks How nice in the start by. You won't get away with that. Ow. Expelliarmus. That is gonna be a late for you to learn That is gonna be a sit from E my guy. I don't even know if I have more uh Molo Sweet, do I? Oh I do. Oh dear god. I don't know. I don't know what to do. What do I do? Expelliant! Levioso! I don't know what to do with him. Rebellion. Um. Well. Um. It's got green stuff on it. No, these are the curses. Um, uh, will it tell me if I, like, lack the required spell or something? Let me go, sir. Arrest the momentum. Accio. Defulsa. Well, I don't know. I'm kind of thinking I don't have the required spell, because I don't get it. I guess if you are a knower, feel free to let me know if I lack what is required. I will I will accept that backseat. You do have the spell. So I'm looking at green and I'm like Incendio. Mm. Wingardium Leviosa. Revelio. Wingardium Leviosa. Try that, didn't I? Defender. Capulso. Accio. Clasius. Leviosa. Arresto Momentum. Wingardium Leviosa. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Incendio. Figured it out. Confringo. Rebellio. Confringo. That's simple enough, I guess. Just destroy them all. Destroy them all. Destroy them all. Destroy us all. Uh, 
Oh, uh, can I go in this cave? Uh, looks like it. Revelio. Scholarly cloak. Ooh, I need to level up first. Just cast Hyper Beam. But what will I do on my next turn? It is actually pretty crazy how big of an FPS difference I notice when I um have DLSS on. It must work pretty well. Ooh, a castle. This place has seen better days. And how? The fuck? This should be fun. Uh, okay, land. No more happy days. For land. You. No landing is available. Land. Well, what? What? What do you mean? It is unavailable. Just warming up. Good for you. Send it. 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 Rebellion. Tap G to heal. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, sorry, Dark Mongol. That was that was that was cruel and unusual punishment. I'm sorry. I know a Merlin trial when I see one. I got an upgraded hat. Am I destroying more rocks? Oh, maybe you need a different spell. Incendio. Oh. Uh. Time to try every spell I've got again. Arrest on momentum. It's a rock. Um, Descender. Revelio. Arrest on momentum. Hmm. Expelliarmus. 
Good for you. Incendio. Defendo. Well, shit, brother, I don't know. Repair. It could be. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Incendio. Defendo. Arresto Momentum. I mean, freezing it does look like it, like, you know, affected it. Yeah, I don't have Bombarda, so I might need that. I don't know. Rebellion. Where are you on the map? Here. Hmm. Well, Mr. Merlin, I don't know. Revelio. I don't know, main. Accio. Capulso. Revelio. Glacius. Defendo. Incendio. Glacius. Incendio. Glacius. Confringo. Glacius. Expelliarmus. Okay. Gotta go. Found a cave. Fine then. Keep your secrets. Revelio. What the floor doing? Accio. Revelio. The only thing it's showing me is a, a box. Okay. Surgers. Butterflies? Are these just for decor or... Or do they actually respond to this? Lumos. Oh. More over there. Should we take them to be together? Perhaps. I don't actually know what these are here for. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Whatever works. Lumos. 
I was gonna try to, like, bring him to the other patch of butterflies, but nope, that makes sense, yeah. Oh boy, I still need at least one more. No, I need, like, two more patches, though. Where the fuck? Time to get on my broom and look around. Ah, oh, jeez. Well, these aren't butterflies, are they? Who's that? Stop it! Stop it. Ah. That was pitiful! further down because I'm seeing red dots down there no it's showing the enemies is like right here unless it's like literally underneath me hmm Incendio. Well. Ah. Hello. I can go look. Oh, yeah. Cinnamon bark. It seems that at least one goblin finds the food at the encampment a bit bland and has taken to adding a cinnamon bark to their stew to liven it up a bit. What do you know? I see butterflies on the map, actually. Oh, oh ouch. I have no quaffles with you. Um, I hope so, Try. I would like to, but I do know Robin needs help with homework, so... Gonna have to do that first, but if I can get that done with quickly enough, then yes, I would like to. Rebellion. Lumos. How do I not break my knees? Oh, it was just the three. Oh, sweet. I again reiterate, I can tell that I really enjoy this game because 
I'm going out of my way to do little side content like this purely because I'm having fun doing it. It feels like I'd be missing out by not. Right, what's all these in? Revelio. Nifflers. Don't think I have any nifflers. There, there. Not going to hurt you. Gonna have to put one in the old collection. They're like moles, kind of. What are they like dragons? They collect freaking loot. I haven't a clue why there's such a fuss over Pokemon. What is attacking me? You will suffer. Shall we finish what we start? Blazing. Defend us. It's a Hey. Ugh. Shame you're so foul. Getting better at this hole. Not enough Molo, sweet. Damn. Ran out again. I'm gonna find a place I can buy like an absolute shitload. One less human to worry about. Revelio. Hello. What are you selling? Revelio. The Feldcroft Well. The well in Feldcroft ran dry some 400 years ago during a great drought. Sadly, many perished as a result, including at least one young boy whose father refused to speak for years thereafter. Legend says that all was saved when a group of benevolent witches and wizards used a never before seen powerful magic to restore water to the region. Oh, hey, we saw that in a cutscene. Now you should be able to travel to and from Feldcroft. Well, after quite a bit of a detour, I'm ready for your quest, my friend. You made it. I've been sitting here all night, man. Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Rookwood. Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it. Even after Anne was cursed by one of them. <gasps> Possibly with a wand, no less. No. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. 
which is saying Just something, the knowing three the of ominous. Us. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anna I used to know. Mm. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. Aye, this then. way. Your character look like Roydy on purpose. Feldcroft used to be a lot lively. Ain't no way. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Akio. Wanted to bring him with us. Here oh, we are. Get out of there. My sister should be just inside. We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel things cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> What kind of a curse does she have? I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Yeah. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. I'm sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Are you all right, Anne? I, I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. And I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in balance. Oh, the phone boys. We got a 47 month resub from Denisov. It's nice to meet you. Yo, thank you, you so much, Denisov, for the 47 years of being sent. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh, dear Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother and me in line. I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cozy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. Thanks again, Denisov, for the 47 months. I wasn't prepared months. for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Hmm. Sebastian cannot Doubt. take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. There's probably a way. I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Have you Thank tried you plot armor? By. Hmm. Very effective. I wish you well. Flashbang. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. I'm so sorry. I understand you've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's to no avail. We have. My nephew thinks he knows better than the healers. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne. You're the a wizard. And she tried resetting the router. Anytime soon, giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalist's way. Hope could be a good thing. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. 
You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. Hmm. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. Hmm. I hope you remember what I've said. Good day. I, I said good day. How Sebastian's faring. I gotta hide this silly hat, man. Damn, that's pretty dope. Oh! Fancy! Oh my god! That... <laughs> I just look like a... Like a frat boy. Oh yeah, that's pretty smart. I like that. Oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nah, I'm going with that, bro. That that's drip. I don't give that that that's drip, man. Yeah, you are right though. It doesn't look very Hufflepuff, does it? Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance at what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. I'll admit, I wasn't expecting him to be so angry. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son. As if that's an insult. I'm mm. the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain Smiley is more face. than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Okay. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. I agree. Hold on, Sebastian. All the debris there's, there's a scroll over from here. from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. Rebellion! They've been digging for something. Quickly! Practice dummies! Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I think I leveled up. I did. Level 22. I am enjoying this game very much. Yeah, I'm pretty sure level 22 I get a new piece of gear. Mm. That's the one. Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. I... How much longer are we expected to dig through this rubble? Ramrock now. Time to fight some mo some motherfuckers. It's an honor to be a part of it. Defend the Goblins will finally rule. Expelliarmus. Incendio. From shoes to chapeau. I don't even know what that means, bro. One less human. Incendio. Uh, Expelliarmus. I won't rest. Come in here. Confringo. Uh, 
Oh. I think I got shot by a bolt or something. Unlucky. Last haw. I'll bury you in the deepest. Someone in the hell, I should have stopped him. For the orbit. No! It's a day. What is it, boy? What do you smell? <laughs> Sniffer? Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelt smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. They were trying to hide something. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at Billywigs, but I keep Billy thinking Wigs. that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. <laughs> Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? Aye. They seem to have set up camp here Rebellion. for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. <laughs> Whose home was this? A bit abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries ago. Hmm. But that's all I ever heard. Orange Eye of yeah. Newt Goggles. Rebellion. A well? This well looks familiar. Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. It's true, I have. I remember. 
sense when I when I viewed that scene from the past of the uh, the Hogwarts founders. Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be, but it looks to me as though this was intentional. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you- I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library. I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic yep. that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. Yep. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Yep. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers yep. hundreds of years ago. Yep. If I didn't know you, I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Look at this. Revenge. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Only one way to find out. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. That hurt me. It is my second week in the camp. More arrive each day. The muggle doctors and even some of our own healers are doing all they can to care for I'm them. not sure what I did to deserve that. The grief is palpable. The ones who have survived the plague are forever damaged by their loss. A fever may pass, the skin may mend and scar, but the devastating sorrow remains. I saw a man, much like my father, who had lost a child. I couldn't bear it. I longed to give him some shred of relief. I'm beginning to think that the others are wrong. I have the power to help these souls. It seems as arbitrary not to help them as it would be to rid them of their torment. Torment. A journal entry of his adorers. I should hold on to this. I traveled here to learn, but I longed to help. My internal struggle is overwhelming. It's as though the magic wants to heal and I'm the one preventing it from doing so. Should I lose hope? Will I forever regret not having done more? I cannot look into their eyes, knowing that I could lessen the burden of heartache. I saw the man leaving camp today, the one who so reminded me of my father. Surely it wouldn't hurt to help him. I could further my research, of course, but that would be a fortuitous consequence of doing something good with this ability. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Okay, sounds good. Revelio. We should be able to. Robin messaged me and said she uh, she's going to bed, so we should be good to go. Revelli, you're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. I know it sounds strange, but honestly, I nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. This dude just spent $10 to watch me wave a big banana. Can I please get an XO tab in the chat? Honestly, Nerd stick, before. thank you for we the can. tier 2 62 month resub. Ah, you're doing you know, my friend. Understood. I appreciate the generosity. Well then, invisible secret Thanks for not only 62 months, but the tier 2. Here we come. I'm tempted to hold my breath. 
So I found, like, a portal to Hogwarts. Or no. Or is, is under... Is Undercroft not, like, the room under Hogwarts we were at? I think it is. Their little hidden room? Yeah, it totally is. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. What the? I feel like we are surely up to no good right now. Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. Rune diagram. Anything helpful in the note? A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago. And Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. His lot. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You oh. did not. Sounds worth looking into. What the into. hell's a scriptorium? Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Till then. Interesting. I completed a main quest. This is the part where I get spammed with like 14 emails, probably. Yep, there's two. Astronomy class. Oh no, that's actually it. This looks like astronomy class. There's only one more defense for way for less off and eh, CPA. Well, let's go learn about Sagittarius, or whatever the fuck astronomy is. <clears throat> I'm a broccoli. We're learning about as astronomy. Yeah. Just like you're a Taurus, I'm a broccoli. I apparently I'm supposed to suck. Yeah. Everybody always says that Geminis are bad. Mercury and, and Gatorade. And reading is the dragon. It's a tarot card. That's isn't it? exciting, I suppose. I'm course, I'm Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Yeah. No, no, I still gotta get way more of the statues. Ladies, Professor Shaw. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. Hmm. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Poggers? It's a bit chilly, you know. Still don't have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar.
Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no. Bring it into focus on your own. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of glass. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. I am enjoying Look it. It's a lot of fun. Look to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very self-same stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Hello. I don't believe we've met officially. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. What a homie. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. Ooh. You've heard of it, I assume? Of course. I mean, of course you have. Right. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first-rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I... I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right under. Because I changed the pitch it. of my voice, some, and I don't uh, know, it just it made it sound weird. To finish on the lower deck, come find me there I don't afterwards. Know the bug or what, but... Bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Oh, okay. I, I, I literally just met you. I don't know. I tried to put off my stargazing as long as I could. <laughs> All of good that did. How am I supposed to find Sirius when my hands are too cold to use a telescope? It's a dog, isn't it? It's a dog, isn't it? This was his old telescope. <laughs> Looks practically brand new. Confringo! Oh. Collect field pages on Hogwarts. 23 out of 25. Hey, look at me. We miss him too. A pristine night for stargazing. Do not let it be wasted. Does seem quite pretty. Oh no, I hear peeves. Oh no. The perfect night for... I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is, um, something else. Okay. Yes, what is it? You remember those astronomy tables? Yo, what's up, Nick? How you doing, fella? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. And you'd like help finding it? And you need someone to help find it. I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Mm. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Sounds exciting. I'm in. No need to convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Shall we? Aye, lady, we shall. Hi, cab of ending. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something that doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Centaurs, you say? Huh. Rebellion. It's nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the glass from now and then. Yeah, you nerd. It's not that creepy out here at night, is it? The Gobstones Club are cowards. Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? Uh, if you're sure. I'm proud of you, Amit. I just bonked my head on that. 
A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as rebellion. Tidy. Well, what did, what did this bathtub do, man? They got him locked up. Cage in a bathtub. This bathtub has been kept behind lock and key for as long as anyone can remember. Rumor has it that the tub was enchanted to chase after students decades ago who were too obsessed with their studies to care much for personal hygiene. <laughs> I do, yeah. Exclamation point mammal OT in the chat. Spider. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Oh, I think they might. Oh, no. Not this close to school, I mean. This is a stargazing table if I've ever seen one. What are we saying, Amit? The constellation should appear near the center of your view. As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Lyra. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Space. Space, 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 space. Thank you, Amit. Go I look space, forward to space, reading space, them. Space. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like Some this one throughout the grounds and forest. Cowboy. All beckoning to be discovered yeah. by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. Oh. That's quite generous. Thank you. What a guy. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. A what? I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Hmm. Um, mm -hmm. Anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. This man said gobbledygook. Ah, never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. What a view. Yeah, get a, get, get a move on there, pal. Our business has, compl has concluded. In the shadow of the bloodline. Oh, dear. We're back with Sebastian. They're arguing in the Great Hall. Well, not in the Hufflepuff common room, I'll tell you that much, but... Oh, let's see what Sebastian's problem is. Revelio. What's that noise? Fuck you, peeves. Whee! Apple. What the fuck was that? <laughs> House Point Hourglass. These large ornate hourglasses containing rubies, diamonds, sapphires, and emeralds are enchanted to keep count of house points for Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin respectfully. Hey, that's 25 out of 25 uh, field pages in Hogwarts. Oh, I suppose my webcam's hiding it, but... Mm. Rebellion. 
heard that. Ooh, the Great Hall. Anything to do with the Dark Heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. Oh, I can't agree. 25 out of 25 for the next reward. Huh. I'm sorry. Oh, I see. Unlucky. I won't give up. What were you and Omina speaking about? He's being ridiculous. Apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Omina swears it was used for the Dark Arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. The dark arts do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. His family history. I'd like to know more about it if you wouldn't mind telling me. I won't repeat it. Very well. But do keep this between us. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus Curse? I'm not. What does the Cruciatus Curse do? It's known as the Torture Curse. Crucio. It inflicts intense, excruciating pain on the victim. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting it on muggles for sport. Oh. Ominous described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific. So the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. As punishment, his family cast it on him. Jesus. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. That's pretty fucked up. How horrible. Poor Ominous. He was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. All right. I'll make Ominous understand. He'll change his mind. Okay, bye. What are we having for dinner in the Great Hall? Oh, you know, we got bread. We got, uh... Anybody know what the fuck that is? Fruit, probably. Um... Some sort of soup. Definitely chicken legs. Uh, perhaps a turkey with, I don't know... Good evening, students. Hurry, Potters! Oh, hey. Rebellion. Oh, page. Owl Lectern. Hey, you can, uh, make some telly tabs. Oh. <laughs> All right, I think we'll call it a night there.